Hello, my name is Daniela and I was acting as Bibu, the news reporter and some bullet. Hi, my name is Michael, I play as Nehemiah and I got to rebuild the walls of my hometown of Jerusalem. Hi, my name is Thomas, I play a news presenter, Mina and Tobia, one of the people against Nehemiah. Thank you. Hello, my name is Aksani, I play as Sarah, the news presenter and one of the locals. Thank you. Hello, my name is Mahareel. I play one of the locals and the weather woman. Thank you. Good morning and welcome to News for Coptic People who are on their couches drinking gahwa. I am Sarah. And I am Mina. And we have only the latest news for you today. First up, school has been cancelled to 2014. Abuna rescues a cat from a burning house. And our top story. In one of the Sunday school classrooms in St. Mary and St. Abram's Church in Brighton, East Sussex, a strange object has been found. One of a kind. A real time machine. What? A time machine? Yes, a real one. Oh, oh, we have signal coming in from our correspondent who is at the church now. Hello, Bibo. Bibo, can you hear me? Hello? Hi, yes, I can hear you. I am reporting from the church. Just behind me here is the fascinating new object that has appeared out of nowhere. Um, have you tried it yet? No, but I'm about to. Come inside for an adventure. Bibo. Bibo, can you still hear us? Bibo, where are you? It seems that we have lost connection with him. I wonder what's happened. Oh, oh, I think we're back. Bebo, Bebo, can you hear me now? I don't know. I just go inside. It started moving so fast and suddenly I find myself here in this amazing place. It's like a castle. Excuse me, where am I and what is this place? What? How do you not know where you are? This is King Atixerix's castle. King who? King Atixerix. Who are you? Why are you dressed like that? Oh, hi. My name is Vivo. And do you like my shirt? It's Hollister. And so are my shorts. What's Hollister? And how do you come here? That's not the main story. What I wanted to know is that why were you so upset in your story? Who are you? And... Yeah. I'm Nehemiah. I'm a Jew. And I work here in this castle in Berger for the king. I'm, so, I'm sad because I found out that the walls of my hometown, Jerusalem, have been broken down. I've prayed and fasted to God because I can't bear to see it in ruins. Oh, that's so sad. So what are you going to do? I've prayed and now I'm going to go ask the king if I could go back and rebuild my hometown. Good luck, Nehemiah. Can you tell me what happens? Yes, I'll come back and tell you everything. Okay, thank you. Well, as you can see, this time machine really works. This is great. So? The, ki the king was very kind. He would let me go back and rebuild it. That's, this is great news. Can I come with you? Yes. How long will it take and how will we get there? Mm, it will only take three weeks walking. Three weeks? Oh, is it alright if I can come catch up with you? Whatever suits you. Farewell. Okay, thank you. What a sad story. Imagine if your hometown was burnt and destroyed. Nehemiah is brave to go back and help rebuild the wall. And it is so great that he, that he prayed and fasted even before he went to the king. Well, we know that God will be with them. Look at the ruins of our city. Everything's been destroyed. There's rubbish everywhere. There's no hope. Come and let us rebuild our city so it might come great once again. It's a tough job, as we all see, but God is on our side. We must have faith. God has answered my prayers, and even the king is on our side. Nehemiah is right. If we all work and pray together, God, uh, will, God will help us rebuild our city. The wall. Come on, everyone. Get up and start working. Good 
What are these pathetic Jews doing? Do they really think that they could build this wall with all these broken and burnt stones? Whatever they build, even if a fox goes up upon it, it will break down their stone wall. Don't be foolish. You'll never be able to build this. Hear us, O oh our Lord, for we have been attacked, and let all their plans fail. Nehemiah, what if they're plotting something? Keep working. I remember that God is with us. Thirty days later. The war is almost done because we have all been praying and working together. Look at how far they've got. They've almost finished the war with, their, with the help from their God. We must protect them now before they finish. We will go to war with them. The wall is complete. Thank you, God. It has only taken us 52 days. Well done, everyone. I cannot believe it. They have rebuilt the wall with the help of their God. All our efforts to destroy have failed. Let us go. This is great news. The wall of Jerusalem has finally been rebuilt again. Thanks, Nehemiah, for sharing with us this amazing story. I guess it's time for me to go. It was lovely to meet you, Bebo. Oh, Thanks for coming. Story. Nehemiah knew that God was helping them rebuild the wall and he wouldn't let anyone discourage them or stop the building. This teaches us faith. If God is with us, nothing should discourage us. We must always trust in him. Well, I hope you've enjoyed news for Coptic people who are on their couches drinking gahwa as much as we did. We'll be with you tomorrow at 6pm. And now for the weather. It's raining Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and every day of the year. Goodbye! Dun 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 dun! Shh.